Hey, what's going on, everybody? It is Gully here. Welcome back to some more epic Polytopia gameplay. We're going to be doing another random multiplayer match. Let's just hop right into it. Normal Drylands map. Sounds good. Uh, feels good to be back. Been a hot minute since we've done one of these. Let's just level up our capital, take workshop. You know how it is. This away? Sure. Just went ahead and took barter. You know, can't really go wrong. I need the handicap because it's been so long, guys. Come on, please be a village. Oh, Simanti. Okay, but we found a village, so that's nice, I guess. Still, Simanti on a drylands map. This small, especially. Very scary. Oh, boy. Oh, it's worth mentioning that um, since we're doing a multiplayer match and we are in the diplomacy beta, the effects of the beta do not occur during the multiplayer match. So, like, I can't get diplomacy and strategy just gives me defenders. Well, let's go on to that village. This guy's gonna go north, and we'll just train a third warrior. End our turn. Pretty standard barter stuff going on, you know how it is. Looking like we're gonna need the organization tech. Let's move you north. Another village, very cool. Let's snag organization. Or maybe we take riding. You know what, let's do riding. Just level this up and get an explore, and see what we're looking at here. Do we reveal Simanti? No. He's probably roughly in this area based on the terrain here. I was kind of hoping that I would have met him and then I could have trained a rider on my capital, but it's all right. I'm considering just rushing chivalry because we can get free spirit in two turns. Clear force still gives us two stars and we have quite a few force we can chop and then we'll just be able to get chivalry. Knights counter Simanti pretty hard, so that might be a play. Move this guy here and we can afford one rider and we will end our turn. Okay, this should be a pretty big turn for us. Let's move you onto that village. We are going to grab Free Spirit and capture the city. Move this guy here and put this rider right here. Okay, now some chopping's going to happen. Get rid of all these forests. Might grab Organization next turn. Kind of want a unit here in case some random hexapods come zooming from here. Got nine stars. Okay, let's grab Organization. We can hunt that, clear the forest, and harvest the fruit there. And we'll grab an explorer. Please, ah yes, there they are. Okay, six stars from Simanti. There's their capital, and there's their shaman. Okay, we got six stars. That means we can upgrade our capital. We'll take resources and train a rider. Then we'll go ahead and end our turn. Not a bad turn at all right there. Let's keep our eyes on this man. Oh, there's a mountain rune right there. Might be worth getting climbing, snagging that. Hi, boarders. How are you? That's a little scary. We are spreading pretty quickly, though. He does have hexapods. That's not very cool, but we'll make do, I hope. Just move on to these villages here. Chivalry is 13 stars. Let's just capture this. Level up that city over there, take resources, and then we can go over here and level up this city. Workshop, and we'll level it up again. That'll give us resources. And we're just going to chop all of this. You can see why they made uh, clear forest back to one star instead of two. Move this guy north. Train a rider. We'll just get a warrior there. Well, we'll get a rider. And a rider here. And train a warrior. No need to attack that guy. I think we're good. And our turn. Kind of moved his warriors back. He's got a hexapod here. And he's got this other one up here. I think a shaman is near that too. He'll probably boost it? He did not. Okay. I am very afraid of Simanti. I know they nerfed them. I think hexapods are three stars now, right? Uh, this guy's gonna look for a ruin. Should I grab Rhodes? I probably should. Rhodes is pretty good. Yeah, let's do it. Because our tech cost is about to go up. Take both of these cities. Now that's what I call a gamer moment. We're gonna do some chopping. A whole lot of chopping, in fact. Forest? Who needs them? We are going to start the roads. That'll level up. Let's get an explorer. Please go north. It did not. Okay, cool. Go ahead and chop these forests here. Link more cities up. Sooner I get that network monument, sooner I can get a giant. Population growth. We can get a giant this turn, actually. What am I talking about? There's the network monument. That's a giant. This boy's gonna go here. There's a village. Sweet. Hmm, we have two monuments. What do we do with them? I can put them here and, like, get resources. I might just hold on to them for now, honestly. Well, I'll put one here. Resources. And I might put the other one here and take population growth. Or no, border growth. Let's do that, actually. And we can hunt. Clear that forest. Clear this forest. 
and we'll go ahead and train another warrior and get a rider here. Now that was a turn. Let's go ahead and end it. Might grab climbing and then maybe even mining, depending on how much metal we got going on here. They've opted for a city wall in their capital. Hey, Hexpod. Ooh, another Hexpod. He's in a pretty good spot for us to do a bit of bouncing. He's got a Hexapod on his capital. We could kill it this turn, actually. Huh. But, I mean, you know what? Where's the fun in that, right? You're gonna go on this ruin. You're gonna go up to help defend him. Uh, we'll move on to that village. Move our giant forward. Watch this play. Zoom this guy in. Bonk. You're gonna go onto that ruin. Oh, hello. There is a warrior there. That's interesting. Let's just road this warrior forward. Just to pressure him a little bit. That city's empty. Okay, well... Let's pressure even more, I guess. We'll go in. Zoom. There's a whole lot of metal. The plan was to go chivalry, but that might change. We'll get a rider here. This guy is going to go onto that village, and we'll train another rider here. That is our turn. If we stop him from spreading this way, we are sitting pretty. Let's take a drink of my V8 here. I don't know what it is about V8s, but they just taste so good to me for some reason. Not sponsored. But like I got this black cherry one right here. It's just, I don't know. It tastes like I prefer it over soda. Now, do I prefer it over cherry Coke? That's another story. It's close. It's close. I don't know if I could pick one. I have no clue where this guy's shaman went. It's just gone. The man just hit my warrior. What a jerk. He left that city open? Cool. Ruin gives us... Chivalry, okay. <laughs> Thank you, game. You know, after getting trade on a drylands map multiple times from ruins, getting chivalry kind of makes up for it. He left all of his cities open. Is he just like, is he giving up? Is that what's going on here? Uh, this rider is going to get poisoned, but that's okay. We're on his capital. Now, there should be a couple of hexapods sneaking around here somewhere. There's one. I guess we'll go onto that ruin. Okay, good vision there. Just put our giant forward. Train a knight, I guess. <laughs> capture that village, capture that village. And night spam will commence. Let's just hit this guy. And go onto that mountain. There's the shaman. I knew he was creeping around somewhere. Alright, we can end our turn there, I think. How close is he to a giant here? Or, I guess, a centipede. It's level three. Okay. We're fine, I think. Now, I think he can end our siege here. We'll have to see what he decides to do. Is he not going to take back his capital with that guy? Okay, maybe he has some more riders here or something. Not riders, hexapods. We got stars from the ruin. I think he might have forgot that I just need the capital to win. Unless his hexapod did not kill that rider, but I'm pretty sure it did. It's poisoned. Well, that's a little underwhelming. You know what? I won't stand for this. He made a mistake. I'm not going to punish him too bad for it. Uh, I'll just move into it with a 5 HP. Could I have one right there? Yes. Look, I just got knights. I kind of want to use them. You know what I'm saying? You're going to get poisoned. That's fine. Or maybe that was him resigning, only he just didn't want to actually resign. Well, I don't I don't want him to think that I'm just wasting his time, either. Oh, no matter what I do, I feel like a jerk. <laughs> okay, let's see what he does. Alright, I'm not going to waste his time anymore. That's the game, my friends. Okay, well, I can see why Clear Forest was brought back down to a one-star reward instead of two. That was freaking insane. <laughs> um... Yeah, that's probably a balance that needed to happen. Barter just kind of steamrolled. And honestly, Symanti isn't too scary anymore. You know, now that we kind of have an idea of how to counter them. It's been long enough. And they also got nerfed. So, I mean, yeah. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, be sure to hit the like button down below. Subscribe for more epic Polytopia gameplay. And I'll see you all in the next video. Have a spectacular day.